Well, I think the, the key differences um, are in a few areas. I think the first is um, just having a, a much richer set of tools for how you can present your video. So, for example, um, you know, we offer a lot of different templates that can be used to present video, maybe a, an embedded experience, uh, uh, an experience with like a channel with lots of different uh, videos. Um, there's tools to kind of contextually integrate video into your site dynamically using uh, web toolkits and APIs. So there's a lot more control over how video can be organized and presented, and, and that's a really important difference uh, between just putting an embedded video in a page. Um, obviously, um, you know, there, the, the brand control is related to that, which is, um, you know, we really have seen this, this white label space really start to innovate in terms of how you can create very, very custom brand experiences uh, around, uh, around the video itself. Um, I think another really critical difference is, you know, people who run websites, they want to have vendors that they can rely upon to get support and assistance. And, you know, it's sort of classic technology services businesses um, that website owner or the web developer or publisher working on it, they want, if they have a technical issue, they want to be able to reach out to tech support and go through a knowledge base and go into a forum where you've got active discussion around those products and services. And so I think uh, that, that kind of vendor-oriented approach is also a really critical difference, whereas in the sharing sites, you're just like any other consumer and there really aren't those kinds of, of resources available to you. Um, those are, you know, certainly some of the initial differences. There are many, many others, I think, as you start to get into things like um, the, the control over where you can distribute your content. Uh, you know, I think white label uh, services tend to um, have a lot more uh, features in terms of how you can make that content syndicated out to other sites uh, or, uh, or even take advantage of things like mobile devices and do that more readily. Um, so I think those are some of the other differences as well.